Let's take a live look outside right now. It is a gorgeous day, isn't it? Look at that. Uh, no, well, just a few clouds in the sky, I should say. Barely any. <laughs> <laughs> Let's check in with Craig Herrera. Craig, gorgeous. it's really tempting to go outside and go to the park right now, but of course, we want to urge everyone to just stay in your neighborhood, maybe enjoy the patio. Yeah, exactly. Uh, if you've got a nice patio, maybe a backyard. Uh, I've noticed some people walking around in the neighborhood. And the good thing that I've noticed when I'm out walking the dogs is people tend to cross the street or give each other plenty of space as they cross, which is always good. So keep practicing that, especially as we've got a pretty decent weekend ahead. A little cooler tomorrow, but not all that uh, big change, really. Tomorrow will be the rainy day in the morning, but that's it. I shouldn't even say rainy. I should say sprinkles. Let's talk about yesterday. Uh, our good friend and coworker. Uh, King 5 meteorologist Rich Marriott put this together for us. Uh, he did all the research, so I'm going to give him all the credit. Yesterday, we actually reached 69 at SeaTac. The last time we hit 69 at SeaTac was September 26. Whew, that was a long time, a long time to wait for it. Normally, we'll hit 69 on June 8th. Uh, we were in the 60s today, and the earliest that we've ever hit 69 or warmer was February 27th, 1968. So what a day yesterday. Today, so far far we're at 64 at SeaTac and we'll take it considering the average high for this time of year is 57 so we cooled a little bit but not that big of a change. Hey take a look at this I love this Panda Museum tongue out sun out I love that shot send us your pictures use the hashtag K5Spring and look at this cute little one uh, she's pretty in pink right she's playing with the uh, dandelions enjoying the sunshine and the grass out there and then one more for you Tim took this one home when he was downtown he said, uh, you can't make it out, but if you look at the center of the screen, right below where it says Seattle Aquarium, it's got hashtag, we got this, Seattle. Yes, we do. Stay strong, stay well, and stay diligent, especially as the weather it gets nice. Hey, by the way, the pollen count has been in the moderate category, tree pollen yet again, cedar, juniper, alder, birch, cottonwood, and elm. Current numbers, mostly 60s. We do have some 50s closer to Port Angeles, over to Friday Harbor, Oak Harbor. You got a light wind coming in out of the northwest. But compared to 24 hours ago, Shelton and Chehalis, both nine degrees cooler. Uh, Seattle, about five, and Bellingham, two. So we do have a very weak disturbance that's going to pass to the north tomorrow. I call it a weak disturbance because it's not really an organized storm. Uh, when it does, it's just going to give us more in the way of cloud cover and cool us about another four to six degrees tomorrow. Taking a look at Futurecast, 5 o'clock tomorrow, a whole lot of cloud cover comes in, maybe some mist and drizzle. We're looking for the green on the radar for the rain, and notice it's hardly popping up at all. As the winds come in from the north and push this south, we should be done with it and start to see some sunshine after about 1 o'clock tomorrow afternoon. We will stay with upper 50s for highs, but at least we'll have some sunshine. Fast forward to Sunday, we've got mainly clear conditions, a very light breeze. I think we start to lose the sea breeze on Sunday. I was thinking it was going to be a little bit brisk, but the wind's not going to be all that strong at all. We will have some sunshine and we'll get close to 60 degrees on Sunday. So that'll be a nice welcome uh, day for you on Easter. Overnight lows, mostly into the 40s and highs. Tomorrow, we're back at it with upper 50s and a few low 60s. So you can see the change that we're talking about. Here's a look at the seven day forecast. So a a little bit cooler for a couple of days, but again, the sunshine will come out tomorrow afternoon. It'll be sunny on Sunday, just a little bit cooler. Look at that, Mark, Jessica. Is we going to Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday? How's that song go? Let the sunshine.